Jen Etienne, and today I'm going to show you how to make a tropical pineapple punch. Now, pineapple juice isn't used as frequently as it should. It gets a bad rap and it's used in a few cocktail mixers, but really creating a tropical pineapple focused punch will be a real crowd pleaser for you. I'm going to show you how to make a healthy alternative to just using regular soda pop. What we're going to do is reduce the soda pop by adding in coconut water. It's all the rage right now, and what's beautiful about the coconut water is it adds natural sugars, but also that kind of tropical taste that you really do want in a tropical punch. Start by adding one part pineapple juice. The reason I'm using punches rather than exact ingredients is because really everyone has a different punch size. And it's so much easier when you're planning a party to think of things in terms of portions rather than exact measurements. With one part pineapple juice, add in your coconut water. You want to use half as much coconut water as you did the pineapple juice. Then, to give it that effervescent taste that everyone loves about party punches, a little bit of lemon lime soda. About the same amount that you would have used for the coconut water. Give it a nice stir. I can feel those island breezes already. It's a really simple punch to make and your little chefs at home can help you make the next ingredient. Rather than using regular ice cubes, what I've done is I've gone to the bulk aisle at my local market and I've taken um, dried tropical fruit, pineapples and coconuts, and added it to an ice cube tray and then filled it with coconut water. Not only does it add a decorative element to your punch, what it really does is offer a hint of fresh fruit or dried fruit to your party punch. If you don't have time to make complicated frozen ice cubes that are decorative, don't worry. You can always just add in a bundle of frozen tropical fruit. It works well, it doesn't dilute your punch, and it keeps it cool. Now that your punch is chilled, add it to your party glass. And because everyone loves a festive stir, what I've done is taken a piece of frozen pineapple, added it to a skewer, and people can use it as a mix, and you've got a party in a glass. Here's hoping that your next party packs a punch.